Hey all, happy Wednesday. Apple just released the first developer beta of iOS 18.5. Let's talk about it. So this update was just released to developers. A public beta will likely be following soon as well, probably in the next day or so. If not on Thursday, it'll be coming next week. They're usually a day to a week behind. Now, this is a pretty minor update. We were hoping to see some bigger changes, including maybe some of the new, uh, you know, Siri changes and stuff like that. But unfortunately, it doesn't look like it's in the cards. Apple is already gearing up for WWDC coming in June. So there's not that much it's going to put in this update because it's already full steam ahead on iOS 19. That's where you're going to see all the major changes. We just got the full release of iOS 18.4, which had a bunch of bunch of changes in it as well. You can check out that video. It came before this one, I believe. Um, been doing breakout videos on some of the other dedicated features there too. Now I'm going to be getting into this. I'm going to be checking out for other changes and I'll post another follow up video with any changes that I do spot. The build number on this, for those that are curious, is 22F5042G. If you don't know, the closer we get to a release of a software update, that last letter will get closer to A. That represents basically the stability of the build. So right now we're at G, first beta, not going to be particularly stable or anything. It's going to get better as we get close to that release, which should probably come around uh, just before WWDC. I'm going to say maybe into May is what we're looking at. So we'll test this out through April, this release in May, then we'll get the first betas of iOS 19 in the beginning of June. Make sure you guys follow and stay up to date with all the latest Apple news.